Hello everyone, this is Karsten aka ActingFan11 here, and I am here on the newly released Minecraft 1.9 today, here to show you some of my new favorite features that I have found on this updated version. I don't know what all they do, so if you have another favorite that I didn't mention in here, or that you know how to use, please leave it in the comment section below, and thank you for watching. So with this update, we have an addition of a couple new blocks. These are called Purpur uh, blocks, which... Uh, generally spawn I think in the end uh, which gives the end some new uh, textures uh, these are uh, go along with dungeons very nice blocks um, we also have some end stone blocks which look incredibly nice these could be great for desert building I love these blocks um, they would look like great for pyramids or something cool like that uh, definitely something desert oriented uh, I can see a lot of building with these um, so yeah, they look very authentic, they don't look like kind of fake in some of the mod uh, mods that you see, so I'm very highly impressed by some of these blocks. And uh, some of the stairs also look a little bit different when you're scrolling through now, also like that a lot. Um, so let's also look at something else now, we have um, in dual wielding, you can hit the F key and dual wield. Uh, this is a shield here, uh, a new addition for perhaps like an arrow coming in, you could block it with a shield. Uh, it looks very nice, looks very medieval, I love that. Um, and a great thing is um, you could have possibly like a sword um, and you could have the shield here, very nice, and you can switch by hitting the F key. So very cool, very cool indeed. Uh, you right click to use this left side, I believe. Uh, let's see, let's use that again. Hmm, I'm not sure how you use the sword. Whoop, I just lost that. If it's in that side, I'll have to figure that out. But very cool. Uh, dual wielding, you can see now, and both hands. I love that. It's something that was greatly needed to Minecraft and a great improvement. So the next thing is, I'm going to take this off here. If you look at the swords now, it also says when in main hand 1.6% uh, attack speed and 7 attack damage, which gives you some more input on, you know, uh, which is the uh, better sword. Um, and here's something I really want to show you, uh, the bows. They have some new arrows here. Uh, you have a uh, spectral arrow. You uh, let's, let's shoot that. I'm not sure what all these do quite yet, but let's shoot that here. Um, it looks almost like they go farther. That went significantly farther, I do believe. Let's see. Oh, cool. We have a new animation on the hot bar there. Look at that. So if you pull it back, it shows you, hey, you're pulling back an arrow. I love that. Didn't see that until now. Great. All right. So let's um, fly down here. But uh, instead of just doing the normal creative flying, let's try one of my... This is my all-time favorite. And this is something you probably only see in a mod, and I'm glad that it's here. This is the Elytra, I believe I'm pronouncing that correctly. You can put it on as like a chest plate, or I believe is your secondary too, I'm not sure. Um, but it looks really, really cool. Um, by the way, let's uh, look through some of these. You also have some different uh, plants now before we go down. We, let's see, fences, end rod, a chorus plant. And I'm not sure what this is. End crystal. I believe this is how you spawn the ender dragon again, if you wish. A chorus plant, I think that has to be on its own block. Let's see. I don't know. Um, any additions to redstone? Nothing new there. Transportation, we will look at both of those. And miscellaneous, that's, is j that's just about it. Um, okay, let's look at some brewing real quick, guys. Uh, we got some uh, lingering potions, and I promise we will get to the elytra, but the lingering potion, it looks really cool depending on your particles. If you throw this down, it lingers, and it gives you this really cool effect, like, hey, this is where you threw your fire resistance, and it just kind of lingers. Great cloud effect, too. Okay, so I think that's just about it. Any other food stuff? I know that's just about the same. Just about the same combat. We looked at some of the arrows. The arrows have different things like fire resistance, healing, uh, different things if you hit them, so that's kind of cool. Uh, let's see here. Anything else? I think that is it. We got some other things here that I believe you find in uh, the end. All right, let's go ahead and show this, guys. We're going to go to f uh, F5 now love that um so anyways we're gonna jump here i'm gonna hit the space bar i'm actually gonna go to game mode zero to show you this better ready we're gonna space and we are flying now guys and you can just fly around 
and it's such an easier way of transportation. You can't go up though very much or your legs will start doing this because it's showing you, hey, we don't have enough leverage to do that. Um, but you can see, just like that, we are at the other side of this mountain. And this is a great side to show you. Um, by the way, before we get to that, the elytra, one of my all-time favorite things, and I believe you have to craft it with um, end tools, something you find at the end from what I heard from someone else. But overall and creative, that's awesome. Just the overall effect of that. Okay, so we're going to go to the stream here, and boats have been completely redone. If we put a boat down, you can now see we have oars. Uh, and if you hit W, you will see that we are now rowing. And uh, normally, if you were to fall like this on the ground or in the tree like here, it would either stop or your boat would be broken. Uh, we can run directly into things, and the boat does not break. Um, only things that I think it breaks for is lava, which is really, um, I mean, in real life, you would notice that. Uh, hello, wolves. And so basically, they've got different kinds of boats. Uh, you got different uh, different ways to look here. Let's just show them here, give you a quick highlight. So for instance, we got the oak boat, normal here, spruce, birch, jungle, acacia, which is right here, and the dark oak. Different boats, different variety, I love it. So um, there are probably a whole lot more other features in this, but these are my top favorites, the best improvements, I think. Um, a lot of people probably argue the additions to the end are better. Um, I don't go to the end that often, I just prefer some of the creative uh, parts of Minecraft. So this is, these are some of my favorite improvements. So that's basically it, guys. Thank you for watching the 1.9 release. It is officially out now. I'm sure the modded versions like Forge and everything will come out in the upcoming days, weeks, and months. So thank you guys for watching this. Let me know what your favorite parts of this new edition are. And stay tuned for more Minecraft videos. Thank you and goodbye.